Speaker Steve Tilley was joined by lawmakers, family members, and others as he inducted <laughs> Dred Scott into the Hall of Famous Missourians. Born a slave, Dred Scott made history when he sued for his freedom. The case made its way through the Missouri court system before ending up in the U.S. Supreme Court. The country's highest court ruled against Scott, but he was emancipated shortly after during the Civil War. During his address, the speaker claimed Dred Scott was someone more than a court case. Today I ask that everyone see Dred Scott not just the name from a famous court case or a symbol for a chapter in our nation's history that I'm so glad that we're far beyond, but instead simply a human being. Because after all, that's what Scott wanted to be perceived as. Following the Civil War, Scott lived out his days in St. Louis working as a porter. The bust took more than 60 hours to design, according to Spencer Schubert, the sculptor. One of the challenges facing Schubert was the limited number of pictures of Scott, but that didn't stop him from capturing the emotion of Scott's life story. So it's important to have a nod to the anatomy, but really capture the civil rights icon that is Dred Scott and, and, and the entire story and the, the dramatic challenging of authority that, that he did um, to, to you know, make, his, make his name. Scott's bust will now join Walter Cronkite, Stan Musial, and others in the Hall of Famous Missourians. Reporting from the state capitol, I'm Jonathan Lorenz.